<laughs> Good morning. So um, yesterday we went to the dinner and that's whatever thing it was. It was fun. And uh, we were leaving and Mira and I were uh, the last to leave. And one of the band members came up to us and just went, yeah, hi, are you leaving already? Blah, 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 blah. And uh, so I gave him my email address and my Kenyan phone number. Um, because he asked for it, I was like, okay, I don't care. I just want to get out of here so I don't have to talk to you for another two hours. Because I was so tired, it was at Mish 12. And uh, so he, first of all, he sent me three text messages last night. Just, the first one was, have a good blessed night. I just want you to. Then, the next one, half an hour later, please send me your Facebook question mark. A minute later, this is mine. Can you add me? I didn't answer anything. So this morning he sends me, good, mo good morning, good friend. How was your night? I hope you slept well. Well, have a blessed day. Say hello to your sister. I have no idea where he got the sister from, for one thing. And who the hell sent a text message after a two minute conversation? What the hell? I don't understand. <laughs> this makes no sense to me. It just blows my mind. And. Then we met this other chick, uh, well other chick, this chick, um, who'd lived in Sweden for like 26 years or something and I gave her my number as well because she wanted to meet up at some point. Um, and she calls me last night, she calls me last night, like half an hour after we met. I don't understand these people, somebody please enlighten me, this is, it just blows my mind. Oh, this is just too much, too much. I don't understand. <sighs> yeah, so good morning to everyone as well. <laughs> so we're shopping again for a change on the street. We got the gifts from in the first few weeks and there's lots more that we're gonna go and see then we're going to the Maasai market so it should be a fun day then we're going to Kiboko Bay to get some sun so I hope the sun, the sun stays you know up high and hot here again yay <laughs> now this time with the teachers <laughs> <laughs> sorry about that <laughs> I don't think I think it's fine <laughs> don't worry <laughs> <laughs> Second largest lake in the world. Look, there's naked people. <laughs> so they're washing themselves. I don't know if you can see anything. But yeah. That's crazy that they wash themselves here. Just ew. Because that is that is not clean. So yeah. I don't think I'd ever do that. Oh, bottom. So here we go again. Listen to the sound. So pretty. I kind of want to see a crocodile, but you can't really see them apparently. They're disappointed. Just a lot of stuck. Or something. The other guy's trying to fix it and this guy is pushing us. We'll be fine. So they swim. This was so random, but hey, why not? That thing just jumped in! 
little spat today with my husband uh, while I'm here it was about such a ridiculous stupid little thing that doesn't even matter and um, it just made me miss him so much and uh, I promised I wouldn't cry <laughs> oh well here goes nothing yeah you're crying on YouTube crying on camera <laughs> but yeah I miss him so much and sometimes it hurts the fact that he's not here with me and I, yeah, I miss you so much you can't even imagine I know I'm always happy and that's my personality I'm just I'm a bubbly person I guess or I'm, I'm just always happy or whatever but I don't know, I try not to think about all the negative stuff and because this <laughs> this is what happens when I do stuff like missing my husband and missing everyone <laughs> even mom and dad and my sisters and friends and stuff not so much, <laughs> not as much as I miss my husband but I do miss you guys and, uh, Honey, I'm really sorry about today. I mean, I've told you already, and I, I'll probably tell you again in a bit, but I'm sorry about this stupid thing. It's just, well, I have no good reason, <laughs> honestly. I just, I miss you, and I just want to come back home right now. Today's the first day I really feel like I really just want to be back home, and you know what, they said it. this would happen at one month and tomorrow, no, the day after tomorrow will be one month. <laughs> they were so right. So, uh, I think the next week might be a bit depressing. <laughs> I might miss people and miss Finland and miss everything more than I have so far, but it'll pass, that's what they say. But yeah, 
and that's how I'm feeling right now. Everyone else is asleep, and uh, I should probably get to sleep too. But yeah, today was a relatively fun day. We had fun with the teachers and that fish thing. At <laughs> the end of the boat ride was funny. <laughs> Couldn't stop laughing. That was fun. My battery died. Well, almost died at the end. Well, at the Kiboko Bay. So I didn't really get to film as much as I would have wanted to. Plus, I barely have any more space on my computer and my um, USB uh, sticks and memory cards. I've, I've filmed so much and taken so many pictures that I can't upload them fast enough onto the internet so my husband can get, download them and I can delete them of everything that I, have to, I, I store the um, pictures and whatnot on. And I think this memory card is running out of, out of space as well. So, good night and see you tomorrow.